Member for Parks. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Uh, over the term of this government, we've seen a cutback in funding going into regional Australia. We've seen uh, the cessation of the uh, uh, local government programs uh, that were uh, for community infrastructure, for roads, roads of strategic importance, uh, the Stronger Communities program. So the Growing Regions program, uh, which is the, uh, I guess the flagship pro uh, funding program to regional Australia by this government, uh, has been uh, something that my communities have been hanging out for. And I will acknowledge that in the last round, um, uh, five projects in my electorate uh, were funded and the community, those organisations were grateful to receive that funding. Although we've got a problem at the moment now in New South Wales because uh, round two um, closes, the, the applications close uh, in two days' time on the 10th of October. And um, in New South Wales, we've just gone since the 13th of September, where local government has been in a virtually a caretaker mode because of local government elections. We, uh, we haven't had councils. In some cases, in my uh, 19 councils in the Parks electorate, we haven't got a mayor elected yet uh, because of the, uh, the time frame and the complexity of counting in local government. So I'm calling on Minister King uh, to please extend that deadline out uh, for another week or so, so that those councils uh, that have been caught up in the hiatus of local government elections can get that application in. Authorised by Mark Colton, National Party of Australia, Dubbo.